Good morning, Joy friends, and welcome to Morning Joy Blogs with Cynthia. And it is very, very early in the morning on Saturday, October the 9th. We are continuing to look at devotions under the topic of God's sovereignty. And today's title is Abundantly Satisfied. Your faith must come to a place of being satisfied with my will. I won't always lead you down the easiest path because overcoming obstacles and facing your fears strengthens your faith. I know what is best for you. I am with you to perfect your faith, so keeping you from struggles would keep you right where I found you, and I just can't do that. I love you too much. Being satisfied will often mean that you must be emptied of everything. Too often the path you're walking on is not the one I intended and I will need to realign your life with my will. I will need to transform your thinking through my word and you'll need to draw near to me, discerning my voice and being obedient in every way. My blessings are beyond number and my grace cannot be contained. I want you to reap it all. As you are transformed by my promises, you'll find your life starting to fall into place. You'll experience more peace and less fear. You won't worry about the unknowns and what lies ahead because your faith will stand firm. Don't for a moment live unsatisfied. Know that you can be abundantly satisfied in your hope if your hope is in me alone. Jeremiah Chapter 31, verse 14 says, My people will be filled with my blessings, declares the Lord. My friends, as you go through this Saturday, be satisfied. Do not let your life for one moment become unsatisfied because God wants to abundantly satisfy you. But sometimes being satisfied means that he'll have to empty us of everything so that he can transform us and make sure we're on the path that we're supposed to be. God, after all, knows what's best for you. So trust Him. Trust Him and let Him perfect your faith. I love you. Have a great Saturday and I will see you in the morning. Hugs, hugs. Bye. Mm -hmm.